Not so long ago, just 10 or 15 years back, diesel fuel cost almost half as much as gasoline. On top of that, diesel engines have always been renowned for their efficiency. A diesel car will travel at least twice as far as a gasoline-powered one with an engine of similar power and a tank of comparable capacity. These facts made diesel engines highly appealing to motorists. Even their more complex design and higher repair and maintenance costs were offset by the low fuel price and excellent mileage. Demand for diesel cars grew year after year, and nearly every automaker's lineup offered a choice between gasoline and diesel engines. Along with the rising demand for diesel cars, the price of diesel fuel also climbed, eventually catching up to gasoline prices today. As a result, from a practicality standpoint, the hype around diesel cars has subsided. Nevertheless, modern diesels still deliver impressive power, torque, and efficiency. However, some manufacturers have yet to address the noise and vibration issues caused by the much higher cylinder pressures during fuel combustion. There's also the ever-present risk of filling up with off-season fuel, which can lead to cold start problems in freezing weather. Moreover, reliability has become an issue for some diesels due to their increasingly complex designs. In this video, we'll take a look at the most reliable diesel engines, those free of major design flaws or obvious weak spots. What unites them is their durability and high odometer readings. Let's start with the legendary Mercedes OM602 engine, available in 2.5 and 2.9 liter variants. While not exactly a modern engine, no one has yet surpassed its reliability. It was used in many popular Mercedes models until the early 2000s. This, this five-cylinder engine, with two valves per cylinder and a mechanical Bosch high-pressure fuel pump, has rightfully earned its reputation for racking up miles and enduring life's challenges. The number of these engines still running today is impressive. Many have clocked up to 1.5 million kilometers. By today's standards, that's an extraordinary figure. The bar for an exceptional mileage has dropped to half a million kilometers, and few engines reach that mark in good health. For the OM602 though, that's just half, or even a third, of its potential lifespan. Of course, a lot depends on maintenance and consumables. Under ideal conditions, these engines have been known to exceed 2 million kilometers. Produced from 1985 to 2002, they weren't particularly powerful, ranging from 90 to 130 horsepower. But that was the sweet spot for reliability and efficiency. You can find them in the iconic Mercedes W124, as well as the W201, G-Class SUVs, T1 and Sprinter vans, and even the later W210. Bavarian engines are no less deserving of their legendary status. Take the BMW M57 for example. These inline-six diesels weren't just remarkably reliable, they also had a spirited character. This turbo diesel played a big role in reshaping the image of diesel engines. It won the Engine of the Year Award in the 2.5 to 3 liter category from 1999 to 2002, with its variants taking the title again in 2005, 2006, and 2009. Power output ranged from 201 to 286 horsepower across its versions. Produced from 1998 to 2008, it powered most BMW models of that decade, from the 3 Series to the 7 Series. You'll also find it in Range Rovers. The M57 had an equally legendary predecessor, the M51 family. Built from 1991 to 2000, these engines had minor issues like any complex machinery, but serious failures were rare and usually the owner's fault. They easily hit 500,000 kilometers without major repairs, a common milestone for them. By the way, BMW holds the record for the most powerful diesel engine in a passenger car. A 3-liter inline-six with three turbos, built on a modular platform. It, it churns out 381 horsepower, making it unmatched in specific power among diesel engines. You'll find it in full-size SUVs, like the X5 and X6, as well as 5 and 7 series sedans. The performance stats are jaw-dropping. A 7 series sedan, weighing over 2 tons, hits 100 kilometers per hour in 5 to 6 seconds, while sipping just 6 liters of fuel per 100 kilometers. Compare that to gasoline engines with similar specs, which guzzle around 20 liters over the same distance. 